DataKind is a nonprofit dedicated to tackling the world's toughest problems, data science. And we do that by connecting pro bono data scientists, people whose day jobs are in Wall Street or Silicon Valley, to work and volunteer their time with mission-driven organizations, be those charities, nonprofits, NGOs, so that together they can collaboratively use data to better address their problems and make a bigger impact on the world. In many ways, they're more challenging and more demanding than some of the problems that people are facing at work. So it's a, it's a great opportunity for people to stretch and grow and learn whilst giving back to the community. Yesterday we asked a bunch of brainstorming questions that we've called tantalizing questions that really got our, our uh, thoughts moving in the right direction towards answering you know, these big objectives that we wanted to tackle this weekend. Every one of them has kind of sat down with our data set and just absorbed and then jumped in kind of head first. When we're looking for organizations to work with, we really look for a couple of key ingredients. Um, in particular, we look for really an organizational buy-in. You know, is this an organization where from the top down to the lowest field level person who's working with the data themselves down in the trenches, uh, are they really committed to using data science to improve their organization? We have a database of every interaction between 19,000 students that we have worked with over the past 15 years. We just needed the expertise to mine it and find the gold that, that lay underneath. That's going to tell us a lot about where we should be putting our sort of concentrated efforts um, yeah. later on. So getting other people to start thinking about our data differently than I and my colleagues think about it every day has been really, really great. Uh, one thing that we found is there is no lack of demand for these services. We have over 200 organizations who have applied to us looking to receive some kind of data science services. Um, on the other side, I should mention, we also have over 5,000 people who have signed up to volunteer, probably more now across the chapter yep. network. So there's, there's demand on both sides. The idea of being in a room with all these big brains and different skills, we thought, well, let's just throw it out there. We don't know who's going to come, so maybe somebody will have the skills that we need, and maybe in this super intense time period, uh, we can maybe not finish it, but get it started, like get something accomplished. And I think we were able to do that. Every time they, they pull up a visualization or some sort of new graph, I'm always amazed that, it, that I've been sitting there next to them this whole time and I didn't know that that was going to be the, the output. Uh, I'm very proud that at all of these data kind events we get a wide representation of people from business intelligence through programming to statistics all to show up and it's a really great diversity of skills. They're collaborating together which I love. I love to see people who, who don't know each other work together to solve a problem. It's been really amazing and um, just the opportunity to kind of look over their shoulders and, and watch them make this magic has been, uh, it's been extraordinary. It's been super valuable and, and even the, the couple of months of work that's led up to this has been really good for us. Um, we've been able to dig into our data at a deeper level than we normally do and we've, we've found you know, problems with our data that we, we can also tackle. I think it's a very powerful movement to think if all these tech companies come together and we all did our part in the Data for Good movement, at the end of the day, what would that look like? And so Teradata was really happy to kind of present this at Partners and invite everyone to come to the table and just see if we can move, move the needle forward on Data for Good. Well, Teradata has been a huge supporter of DataKind, and we really couldn't have done a lot of what we've done without them. They've been material supporters, but also philosophical supporters for us, really. They are leading the way in using data philanthropy and thinking about how to use their skills for good. So they're perfectly mission aligned with us, and we really look forward to doing a lot more good with them together. You know, it's, it's like having um, an extra staff of 20 people for, for two days. And then you go home and you, you, know, you have this, this, this work with you. And it's, um, it's incredibly valuable. This is absolutely the best volunteer experience I have ever had. <laughs>